It's absolutely beautiful. I've never been in here before, but the whole goal really behind this bird cell project is revitalizing some of these vacant uh, buildings. It's just absolutely beautiful in here. I'm joined now by the co-organizer, Miles Robertson and Nalani, who's actually an artist here at, she has her own exhibit here. So Miles, this has been going on for months. Just tell me a little bit about how all this got started and how it's been going for the past few months. Well, in a lot of ways, it got started with a conversation between Nalani and myself, um, and we thought, Art's a good way to reimagine an abandoned space in the city, and we've got a lot of them. Um, we got access to this space, put a call out for artists, and we've got 28. All right, well, we're excited to hear it again. $10 to visit again at the Birdsell Project. Friday is the closing date for this exhibit, but we're excited to hear what's next for this project, especially right here in South Bend. We're excited to hear it. We're live in South Bend. Suzanne Spencer, WSBT 22 News. All right. They've got gowns, cake. I'm eyeballing the cake for sure. They've got lots of decor, really everything you could possibly need if you're a bride getting married, engaged. It's all here. One of those things, though, is the fashion show. I'm joined by Marcy Sears, who's coordinating all of this. Marcy, we've got some dresses behind us, lots of new styles and sort of things. What can you tell us about this year's fashion show? Well, we have two fashion shows this year. We've got lots of information you can know if you're planning on getting married, if you're engaged. We've got Tony Gazana right here. You're in charge of this whole thing. I mean, this is just like months in the making, I can't imagine. So tell me just a little bit about what we've got going on new this year. Well, first of all, what's new is style, and style is always new. Well